our path should be correct, congratulated because they were the first and still the best, I think, in Canada at, uh, at engaging rural physicians and their families. RPAP has been a wonderful, wonderful organization you know, to work for. And I, I can't think of any other days that have that been happier. Rural physicians teach well and give great experience to our students and to our residents. That is something that is a feather in the cap of RPAP and in the cap of every rural physician who not only likes teaching residents to, and students, but is uh, very good at it. It's really added a lot of respect for rural physicians. It was felt we couldn't do very much. We didn't have much interaction with the universities after graduation. RPAP changed that. You know, we had now significant interaction with the universities. We're called on often to participate in committees to do with CME and uh, from all over the province. And I think that uh, when you participate you know, with the university in CME programs, they get a sense of really what the broad, how broad the knowledge is, you know, in the rural community. The more skills you put into a rural community, the, the more you improve retention. And I think that one of the major, you know, goals of RPAP has been not just recruitment, but also retaining their physicians. And I believe one way of retaining a physician is to you know, give them skills and a satisfaction of being able to produce and enhance those skills in the community.